welcome back to Beyond the Pro. Make sure you don't forget to subscribe button and like. Today we will be looking at my train station mock, and as a bonus, we'll be showing you how to build this little car. And and if him, please take this, please if you have any suggestions for my channel, well, there's a link in the description that will very help much help me. So you so you have a little, at least a little opinion or. or Look, or I have some kind of consideration for the city. So let's start off with the train station. The front is the front is more of a castle theme, going with the gray. And that green is that green is kind of like the overgrowth. The front are there these. So we got a car like this one. Can't just ram in. There's a physical barrier there. And we will be showing you how, this is the car we, that I will should be showing you how to build. It can be any car you want, so keep, stay tuned for that, the end. The end, on the top is a slanted roof, roof, and not much detail on the roof, so let's just get into the interior. This is really a metal detector in disguise. And on the inside, there's a red light, and if that flashes, that means, I mean, this the mini, that that a security officer will come check. If it's green, he can just go. So he could just hear this, and it's very big. You might see this from a Lego Batman set that says, you're welcome. I thought it was, I thought it was a nice use of it. Here we have a fence. Not much interior de detail on the front. If you want to see a more detailed interior, make sure you leave a like for that. There's a trash can here. And that means you can control their trash. And, uh, and the train ticket. And train tickets. Or just put them here. And, and then they can wait. And the minifigure can just sit down and wait in right there. Next, and then here's this train. Not much, just just something from the, like a Toy Story line. Just a car from the, from the Toy Story line, and he could just sit on this and move on out. Run out. Not much detail for such a small build. Not nearly as much as compared to my as to my my that or really brown look food stall, but it's a decent stuff. I'll tell you that. Now, for as a bonus, let me show you the car. This is really one of the cars that this has been around for about a year and it has gotten demolished ever since I completely restarted my city, but about a few mo six months ago, I was able to revive it, finally. And now I will show you how to build this classic car. It has gotten some very big changes since, and I don't. And some of it is all, and so some of it's pretty new. So um, I won't really talk too much, and let's just get building. For this build, you will need all these pieces, and I think I should really mention two one by four tiles, a one by two by two plate tile. A one by two tile, two one by two one by ones, two translucent one by ones, two two one two by fours, two one by fours or one one by four and three one by fours. This or another one, or and you also need another one by two. Two of these curved pieces. Four of these one by twos, one by twos with the, uh, I think these are not called, with the stud on the side, just some cut wheels, two by three, a two by two, a seat, is there anything else, uh, and, the, and the steering wheel, and this one by four connected top, and I think that's all the piece, pieces, so let's get to it. This is probably the first time I'm building it with the video. 
So you first take the wheels and put it underneath this one, one by two by four. Then put another one. Then the two by three. Next, next, I want you to everyone to put this piece right there. The, the, the piece, the first piece. And it's kind of important you have this. And it's okay if you have a bigger one. Make a bigger one would actually look good on this. But let's just get back to the build. Put two of these one by twos or one, or one by four right here. And then take those one by two, one by one bricks with the stud on the side. Put them on right there so it faces this way. Keep that to the side. And now we're going to build the front. So take two of these bricks, put them on the sides, two in the middle, that's that. This is very important, and I hope you're listening. You see this, and then in this brick, there's three different places you can put it. Here, here, and here. I want you to put it in the second one. Like there, like so. And then, you just finish the front. Now let's work on the back. Take a one by two, like a one by two plate, and it's a two by two tile. And then take these slopes, like this, and then add them right there. Then you can just stack these, like so, like so, and then attach them to this, so it creates a U. Like thing, and that attach that looks like it attaches to this brick, but it doesn't. That's pretty important. Next, we're almost finished to a two by two right on the front, a one by two tile right there, the chair, the seat, the, the seat, the steering wheel, the lights go on the back. I know the lights, I know there's no lights in the front, but you can pretend there's lights on the front as well. Or you could pretend that, or you could pretend that this is actually a light. Or you could actually add one in for yourself. And then you want to put, flip these one by four tiles, add one by two at the ends, detach them right there. And then, here you go. That is this car, and I hope you enjoyed this. And I, and then, and they can have a fun time going to the train station and back. And make sure I hope you like this video. Make sure you don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like, and if you have any suggestions, leave them in the link below. Leave them in the suggestions link below. And until then, I hope and watch my channel for more videos on Legos, Lego news. Etc. 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 Make sure to, and then until, and then, until then, I guess. Bye.